what year did you fill it before? The only reason you got into voice acting, or is there another reason? Uh, no, I mean, it's, uh, okay, the reason that most actors, or any performer, uh, besides the artistic part of being creative and finding what works for you, but most people that want to be on stage or in front of a camera, um, tend to have a lot of hero worship and a lot of idol worship and, and, and you know, want to pretend and want to get, I mean, uh, being paid to work in video games or a cartoon. When I was working on Justice League, and I was sitting with The Flash, Green Lantern, you know, the, the, some Green, uh, uh, the Green Lantern Corps guys, Wonder Woman, Hot Girl, and we're all doing this shit. You know, I want to go back in time to my nine-year-old self and be like, dude, it's going to be so awesome. <laughs> you know what I mean? it, and, you know, that, that's, that's what got me into, into acting. And, uh, but originally, I was in music. Uh, those of you who were at Kineticon last year, uh, I DJ the set at the rave. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. And, uh, <laughs> It was awesome, but I, uh, I, if I do say so myself, I, I, uh, I'm a DJ, I'm a club DJ, and paid my way through grad school. When I was getting my MFA, I was, I was DJing in nightclubs in San Francisco, and uh, I gave up music uh, to, to pursue acting because it was just a better fit, but there was still that part of me that wanted to be, you know, superstar DJ behind the one and twos and just be the guy up there and not just down here dancing like I always was, you know? And, and that's, voice acting is the same kind of thing. Like I. I seek out the geek shit. Like I'm, if, if I told my agents, my agents have been, my voiceover agents have been the same agents I've had for 17 years, and yeah, they're not gonna let me go. It's awesome. Uh, but they, uh, they, uh, they made a lot of money with me. I made a lot of money with them. And what they know is, and that's all I get. Man, that's all I get is superheroes, villains, spies, uh, everything. Is all like physical GameStop commercial, anything that's pop culture comes my way because they know I love it. They know that I'm going to put my heart into it. When something comes across my desk, as they say, and it's Roman meal bread, I'm like, no, it's delicious. I mean, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah, it's, it's not a, as good a fit. So.